Hello everyone and welcome back to another plan with me. This plan with me is actually my first one in my brand new 2021 Moxie Life Planner. If you guys are not familiar with this planner, I will pop up my review of the 2021 Moxie Life right up here for you guys to check out if you are interested. Now, let me just tell you that I probably spent the last 30 to 45 minutes trying to figure out exactly which kit I was going to use in this planner. I kept bouncing back between a few Planner Kate kits, a, a few Chrissy Ann Designs kits, one from the Chrissy Ann Designs Celebrations collection, and of course I forgot to order add-ons, all kinds of things like that. Then last week, or maybe it was the week before, my friend Jen sent these Coco Daisy kits over and I was like, these are perfect and they're just not any specific color theme, which is kind of how I was wanting to start off my Moxie Life this year. So I kind of like want to walk you guys through these. I think these are their new kits, the classic planner kit. There's a planner sticker kit, an add-on. I'm not extremely familiar with Coco Daisy, but I have seen some of their stuff and it's really, really nice. So here is, it says it's their classic planner kit, but there's like a lot of things in here that I saw could be used just kind of, oh wait, kind of move some things around that I'd also want to use like in maybe my vision board area. I'm still not even done um, setting up my Moxie Life. Like that's something I was going to do in this upcoming week. But there are some really great um, stickers in here. So not a very like traditional kit. There's this other packet in here. I guess I'm just going to kind of open up everything else. I also grabbed some washi too because I was like, I don't know what exactly it is I'm going to pick but I knew that I really liked the color scheme. I like the stickers that are like, this is your year, make it count, hello, January 2021. I mean, it was just perfect. It's got some of these checklists on here, some habit trackers that'll kind of be fun to use. I like these kind of like typewriter looking um, things over here. Lots of half boxes, thank goodness, because I'm kind of dependent on those. And some of these other additional sheets. Now, again, I'm not exactly sure of the pricing of this stuff because this was gifted to me, but I will leave a link to their website for you. And then there were like some dots and stuff, just a huge variety of stickers here. And then there's still this other pack too. Um, this says it's the add-on sticker kit. So we'll see what's in here. And it's got just some more like decorative stuff, which will kind of be fun for this week because it's gonna be a short work week for me. Um, oh, I love that. Welcome. There's so many welcome 2021, January 2021 things in here. I'm like, which one do I pick? But these are like, these are really, really nice. And like I said, this is kind of some really fun pieces in here that you can use also for your vision board if you wanted to. All right, let's get started. I'm going to kind of try to spread things around near me. should probably get my water out of the way or take a sip of water. It has been a busy Sunday over here. I have already done groceries, gotten my car washed, all kinds of stuff. I think I want to start by, I saw some washi strips here. There's that one. I need to find the other one. That's my only issue with sheets like this is like trying to find the things that'll match or go well. My thing is I want to use this at the bottom. We're going to make it make sense. And then accent it at the very top of the washi with one of the add-ons. And I don't think I brought a ruler over here with me. But in my planner caddy, I had one of these easy bookmarks, which always comes in handy <laughs> if you need to cut something. All right, let's see. First of all, I just want to say I can't, I, I just like, we knew 2021 was coming, right? But like, I'm still kind of like, wow, I'm in my new planner. This is very exciting. So I have the cover in case you guys are interested. I might be all over the place in this video. It's been a hot minute since I filmed one of these. I have the hold on to your vision cover. Absolutely love this cover. It's so, so pretty. And the light might fluctuate too. I'm also filming in my bedroom. I just decided to change up all of the things. <laughs> all right, so I just realized too, that means I won't be using date covers this week, which is interesting for me. Um, another thing is this, this week of this planner is actually in both the 2020 and 
the 2021 version and I was like, I don't know what I want to do. Do I want to stay in that the whole week or, you know, finish out the year in that book or do I want to move over? And I was just too excited to move over and that's what I decided to do. So again, I kind of want to add one of these colorful strips to the top here. Oh, but they're not all the same size. See, why do they do us dirty like that? <laughs> So now I'm trying to see if another sheet has washi on it that I can use. Oh yes, so I found another sheet that's got the same thing, but they're not the same length. Ugh, it's fine, it'll be fine. I might just leave a little bit of space. Yeah, maybe it won't be fine because <laughs> They are, um, oh, they're not exactly the same either, so that's kind of cool. I'm going to kind of make it so that it's kind of sitting right in the middle there. And we have to cut that off. This is like forcing me to get super creative. So again, um, it is the week after Christmas, so we actually don't have a lot going on as far as anything goes other than celebrating the new year. And I have a short work week, like I have already mentioned. All right, I need to add on another piece of something to this and I'm hoping, nope, these washies are tiny. They don't match, they're not the same size. Hmm, maybe this one is. Oh, thank goodness, here we go. Okay, so we can finish off that piece. This definitely forces you to <laughs> think outside the box. Um, so I'm just gonna add it to that piece right there so we can finish that off. I actually like the way that it looks and I'm kind of embarrassed at how long this is taking me, but this is not a regular kit. There we go. So there is that. All right, let's start with the things that we know are happening this week. And that is that I go back to work on Monday. I also have this video going up that you guys are watching right now. I believe that there were some event labels here and they are kind of small and that's totally okay. But I think that that's what I'm going to use to put down my videos for the week. Okay, so I have those written down, but then I realized I want to do, I don't even know. So I kind of want to do like a half box that says that I'm going back to work because I feel like that is a significant event in my world. <laughs> so in case you are not following, I have not been at work for a few, um, almost two weeks. I was out because, where do I want to put this? I kind of want to move this up just a smidge. Um, because I had my cardiac ablation a few weeks ago and it hasn't even been a full two weeks, but it feels like it has been, you know? And um, so I had to stay home for a little bit and I lost my sheet of cigarettes. <laughs> there it is. Um, so I stayed home for a little bit and now I'm going back to work and I'm kind of excited in a way, more like excited because I'm going to be getting out of out of the house, um, if that makes sense. So I'm gonna put my videos down for the week and I'm putting them, putting them down a little bit lower than I normally do because I've also been uploading a little bit later than normal. Vlogmas just sort of set that rhythm for me and I've kind of been loving it. And I mean, from the views, it looks like that's working out better. There is a way for creators to see what times are best for videos to go up and that kind of stuff. So that's kind of cool. All right, so the other thing that I have got going on, and they do give us some quarter boxes, thank goodness, is on Tuesdays and Thursdays, I have my usual work meeting since I will be going back. So I'm going to use the quarter boxes for that. There's so many to choose from on this sheet. I'm just like, my goodness, it doesn't really matter what you pick, they're all great. Okay, so we've got those two, and that's going to be, yeah, Tuesday and Thursday. almost forgot what day that was. 
Um, we have the first off for the holiday, but not New Year's, and I'm not taking any additional time off because I already took extra time off um, this last week or so. All right, so <laughs> it's kind of crazy because without Vlogmas, my schedule has freed up so much. <laughs> Like, I'm just like, I know that I'm forgetting something, but, but I'm really not. And it's totally okay. All right. So on Thursday, no, I'm sorry, on Wednesday, I do want to pick up our New Year's menu stuff. And the only reason why I didn't pick it up earlier was because I felt like a lot of those things would go bad, like produce, fruits and vegetables, things like that. Because, of course, I want to make a board for... Um, New Year's, I think that would be great. And actually the entire family was on board with that. So I'm super excited that they're on board with it. So that's what I'm doing Wednesday. Okay, so I just put New Year's Eve grocery pickup and I'll probably put that here in the afternoon because I'll probably just try to schedule something um, that I can pick up on the way home, like a grocery pickup order. If if I plan accordingly, I, I think that I can get that done. All right, so then we have New Year's Eve, New Year's Day, and I honestly don't know what we're scheduling for um, the rest of the weekend. So I know that I want to use some of the full boxes. And I do have some editing to do because I will have to edit Tuesday afternoon and then Thursday afternoon. I'm going to go back to my regularly scheduled programming of how I do things and I, I'm going to love it. I, it's kind of feeling a little bit good to get back to the swing of things and a little bit of sense of normalcy because the last um, month or so with filming Vlogmas, it was like film, edit, film, edit, film, like every day. And... <laughs> I miss it, but at the same time, I'm kind of like, wow, this is nice to kind of take a step back and take a little bit of a break, you know? So, um, my film and edit days, I love these kind of smaller boxes. They're not quite half boxes. They're not quite full boxes, but we're going to use these. Um, well, they're definitely not full boxes. I don't even know why I said that, but we're going to edit. On <laughs> you know what? We're not going to edit on New Year's Eve. There's just no way that that's happening. So we'll probably edit both, um, Actually, let's do it Monday and Tuesday and just get it done so that I don't have to worry about it on Wednesday because I'll probably want to um, clean up the house and stuff, you know, have everything nice and tidy. I always feel like I do a deep clean right before we like trash the house with a holiday, <laughs> like, like Thanksgiving and Christmas and, and all that stuff. All right, so like I said, now I kind of want to grab all of these sheets that have the full boxes and figure out just how decorative I want to get from here now that I've put down the big chunk of stuff. I'm just trying to see if I really, I love these checklists though. Oh, I need to calm down because I would put those checklists everywhere. All right, so for the first, I really like that this is your year, make it count. But then some of the sheets had the Hello January 2021 on there. I know there was a blue one. This is the only issue with this many sheets of stickers. Okay, this one. I really liked this Hello January. And that's the one that I want to use on this day. And I thought for some reason I put my finger down or my arm down on on a um, pen that was open and I was gonna like destroy my shirt so anywho um, I kind of like this one that says I'm so ready for a new year but like that would be awesome for New Year's Eve uh, let's see and I think I want to put that this is your year make it count right here I don't know about you guys but we're not doing much of anything on <laughs> New Year's Day <laughs> oh my goodness no all right I'm going to start putting the rest of these down. Okay, so I'm not gonna like cover the whole thing. <laughs> I had to like really think about it and I was like, I know that there's going to be things that I want to add and definitely some pictures for New Year's Eve. So 
I don't want to plaster the whole page with stickers, although I know the second I turn the camera off, I'm going to be like, you know what, just cover the whole thing. <laughs> But I'm not going to do that right now. So on Sunday, though, of course, I want to do my filming and editing of the following week's plan with me. So I'm going to grab another half box. And I keep losing. I've been using the Micron 03, by the way. This one actually works really well on stickers and on the Moxie Life paper. But if you are using, like, vinyl stickers, you're going to want to stick to the... Um, the micro perm, my vinyl is coming off on here, but this one's from Chrissy and Designs. But the micro perm is what works best on the vinyl stickers. So on Sunday, I want to do the filming and editing. All right, and now, oh my gosh, I just realized that there was a weekend sticker. I wonder if I can get this sticker up and move it down. Some of these things felt like they were not exactly repositionable, but maybe if I move slowly, <laughs> nope, <laughs> we're gonna leave it exactly where it is. All right, maybe I can get the weekend sticker down kind of over it. Yep, that's not gonna be too bad. I actually really like that. Really, really nice. I kind of love how colorful this is and just how there's not really like a uniform way that I did things, which was probably not, not, not the best. All right, now I want to do my sidebar. And let's see. I kind of like some of these other little boxes where it has like January is a month to, and I'm sorry, I keep shaking my table that I'm at right now. Um, January is a month to kicking off the new year with a little checklist and my word of the year. I kind of like that. And I'm going to put that on the first. Uh, these are too cute. And I might have space for both. Maybe these are a little bit smaller than the actual column. So you kind of got to go over a little bit more. There we go. And then the same for this one. I guess I could have put the word of the year at the top there. It's okay. All right. <laughs> I told you guys I was going to start adding more stuff. All right. So this week I want to put right here. And then I think I'm also going to use the next week sticker as well. I really, really like that. And I never fill this whole thing up anyway. So it will give me a chance to um, kind of break it up into two things right there. And then we've got our habits for the week. And honestly, I haven't at this very moment decided what those habits are going to be. So we're just going to skip over that part. So there, you know what? Oh my God, I cannot believe I forgot this. I actually have my cardiology follow-up on Wednesday. I knew that I was gonna forget something that was like, hello, super important. <laughs> All right, so we are going to use, hmm, let's use, which half box do we wanna use? There's so many that are so freaking cute. There's too many to choose from, that's the problem. All right, nope, let's see. I think we will end up picking probably this one right here, right in the middle. Let me grab my pen. And that is at 10 o'clock on Wednesday. Kind of important. I cannot believe I almost forgot about that. All right. Whew. My goodness. I would have been in a world of trouble had I forgotten about that appointment. Oh, my God. Okay. Awesome. I think, I think that that's the last thing that I forgot. All right. So... There is such a mess around me, you guys, if you guys could see it, it would, <laughs> anyway. All right, so that is everything for this plan with me, the first one in my 2021 Moxie Life Planner. I'm so excited to continue diving into this planner, continue setting my goals and intentions for the year, and I hope that you guys will join me. If you guys like this video, please be sure to give it a thumbs up. Subscribe if you haven't already. If you're already subscribed, make sure you click that red notification bell so that you know when my videos are posted here on YouTube. As always, thank you guys so much for joining me, and I will see you in my next video. Thank you.